new revelations in the trial of Netanyahu. A Hollywood producer on Sunday accused the Israeli Prime Minister of demanding lavish gifts in exchange for favours. Testifying by video link from Brighton in the United Kingdom, Arnon Milchan told the Jerusalem court how Netanyahu and his wife had received expensive cigars and crates of champagne. In exchange, Netanyahu allegedly helped Milchan secure a US visa extension and also pushed tax breaks that would have benefited the producer. Netanyahu appeared in court for Milchan's testimony, and in Brighton, Israeli protesters surrounded the hotel where the producer was speaking. This is part of the greater protest movement that's happening right now in Israel. We're following them wherever they are in the world to make sure that they know that this will not going to happen. Milchan, whose credits include Pretty Woman, Gone Girl and LA Confidential, described how Netanyahu had complained that some of the cigars were the wrong diameter, while his wife had taken issue with the type of champagne they received. The gifts allegedly included jewellery, with a value of around $200,000. The trial began in 2020 and is one of three corruption cases that Netanyahu is facing. He and his wife deny any wrongdoing. The testimony comes as Netanyahu's government resuscitates controversial judicial reforms that it had put on ice in March in the face of widespread protests. Critics claim that the reforms, which reduce the power of Israel's Supreme Court, are intended to shield Netanyahu from the corruption charges. To once again try to ruin the Israeli democracy by making horrible laws. That only goal is to destroy the, demo the democracy of Israel, to destroy uh, any balance between the different branches of the government in order to make it a, a dictatorship at the end of the day. Israel has faced a period of prolonged political instability with five elections in the last four years. And these latest allegations will only serve to deepen an already polarized nation. Rupert Stone, TRT World. Thank you.